Hello guys, this is Deathly and welcome back to another episode of our single player survival. This is episode 34 and today, thankfully, we're not working with the villagers. We've been working with the villagers for the past few episodes and they are a pain to work with and I need a break. So, today we're going to be working in the nether once more digging out some nether tunnels. Digging out, that's not the correct word. Decorating nether tunnels would probably be better. But anyways, in between the last episode and this one, well, as you remember, these are all been pre-recorded up to episode 40 or something. But um, in the time between this episode and the last one, I have been messing about with the villager breeder, as in the rest of the villagers that were required, done some more breeding and stuff. And yeah, it's all been going well. I've also been using some of the drops from that uh, crop farm. Yeah that crop farm for food, so potatoes and stuff because, well, that's a little reliable farm we have right now. <laughs> but yeah, it's been it's been going well. As you can see, we all have all these the 16 villager pails. Yeah, they're all in there and it's working pretty nicely. The only thing is we need to tidy up a bit around about here. There's some loose blocks and stuff that have been left over from when we were taking the villagers up using minecarts and stuff. But yeah, it's, it's been pretty good. Now, the day of recording this, it's like just coming up at 8pm because I haven't been able to record all day because it's been so warm. So yeah, fun right? Anyways, in today's episode we're going to be working on the nether tunnel that, which will take us to the end portal in our world, well the closest one. Because well, yeah I like to decorate these things, plus besides, um, if we come back this way, uh, I also decorated the rest of this tunnel as well and it's looking pretty nice. So um, back along here, <laughs> yes we're all over the place, we're killed right? It's all the way down here, I have all the resources we need in the shulker box as well. Um, come on boat, up here, there we go. And if we just run along here and yeah so if you don't know the end tunnel is all the way down here and here we are so okay that was strange so this is it now before we can even start building we need to tear out the walls because well one they'll get in the way and two come on it's nether rack we don't want nether rack showing do we no not at all so <laughs> let's tear it all out now these episodes that i've been releasing yes you know they're all pre-recorded because well yeah, but I'm at a stage now, I think I've recorded four or five episodes already. And it's, I think they've went well. We've, we've made a ton of progress in this world, more than what we have made recently because we've been working on silly little projects like world building and stuff. But after these pre recorded episodes, we'll kind of die down. We won't do as many technical things as what we have been doing. We can kind of go back to doing all the creative building type things. Because, well, that's what I like doing. The only reason I'm doing all of this kind of technical stuff right now is because then, by the time my vacation is over, well, one, you would have seen everything that's been done, and two, that means we have all of our, all of our infrastructure up and running, which means we can get straight in there and straight ahead with the building process. Now, I think I may have forgotten a few resources, so let's just check our chests. Shocker box, sorry. Yes, I forgot some of them. But yeah, we're going to be using a lot of end items, so we'll take a few of them. And I don't exactly know how I want to do this. I want to do a similar style to this place out here, but I'm not entirely sure as to how to do it. Hmm. This is... This is going to be fun. <laughs> yes. But I want to design this on camera with you so you can go through the same thought process I do. So let's see. So the way I've done this is we have three block, well, five block wide modules in total. So we'll kind of go with the same thing, but how, do, how should we define the model, the modules here? What blocks we put there? Words. <laughs> because we're using a uh, purple as well, so I guess we can use that for the pillars and we can use the purple blocks. So one, two, three. Do something along these lines and one, two, three. 
and you have the half slab variant of them. Well, no, 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 we wouldn't even need the half slabs, we'll have stairs in these segments. So, what if we go one, two, three, one, two, three? I hate counting blocks in the nether because the blocks are so dark, sometimes it can be hard to tell. So, go along. And zombie pigment as well, they've been very, very annoying in this kind of bulk recording seg seg segment type thing. <laughs> Yep, and one, two, three, 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 and there we go. So, hmm, I, I don't know. It's it's very purple. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll do the rest of it to see how it goes, but I'm not entirely happy with this yet. I guess it could be worse, right? And, yeah, hmm. Hmm, no. Do that, that, that. Right. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not entirely happy with this yet because it, it just looks strange. I don't know why it's. It doesn't look right. I guess if we start. Well, we put in these kind of supports on the roof and then we start implementing some more colours, it might help our situation here because in its current state it's not looking too well and I have a little pop up on my screen yeah if I was recording earlier on the day that wouldn't be an issue hmm right so we'll leave this last segment for now and I guess hmm I, I, I don't know about the pillars like the, the pillar blocks themselves are the look out of place, personally. So see, see if we use the endstone bricks in this segment. Uh, so just bear with me, bear with me just a moment. And the purple stairs, because we'll run them along the bottom. And with we've done it here, the stone brick and the chiseled brick, kind of a similar texture, it looks okay there. So technically speaking, it should look okay here as well. Now we could actually be doing with some regular end stone because that might help us in this situation because of you know the way it looks and we might actually need some more purple now if this guy just dies if you're wondering I have smite 5 in that axe and if you jump and do a critical hit you can one shot pigman just for anyone that's wondering of course so race along here hmm. I don't know, it's, it's looking, it, I must admit it does look okay, but I'm not entirely happy with this sort of style, it's, it's too, it's too strange, because you don't normally see this kind of thing, and the overworld for example, well, obviously this is he heading to the end portal, but that doesn't matter. Now what I was thinking is we can use the end rods as well because well, there isn't many builds you can use these. And with the way we've done this, we would have the kind of purple stairs in this segment as well. Hmm. I don't know, this is it's, it's still looking strange to me, <laughs> personally. Must just be the way my eyes are when I look at the, these things. They just look completely out of place. And yes, stairs. So run along. And we will do it in this segment here as well, just so that when you're zooming by in the boat, you can actually see what this uh, tunnel is without having to slow down and look in. Hmm. I don't know. Because we had like walls and stuff, but that wouldn't work here. We could actually use iron bars, but I need to go and find some iron. You know what guys, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and gather some more resources because, well, we've ran out of what we need. <laughs> and when I come back, hopefully we'll be able to make some more progress on this tunnel. Okay guys, I'm back and I have got a few resources, a few different types of things, especially for this segment. I have some iron balls and I also have some glass because I want to test something, so uh, before we even get started, and we still need to work out this top segment, 
as you can see I've put in the end rods already just so we can light up this area because well it's easier to see especially for you guys since we're in the nether and YouTube compression and stuff it may be a little bit difficult but since we have a very very bright nether hub we should be okay but anyways yeah it's we've been able to make this turn relatively quick I'm really happy with how this nether hub has actually been able to turn out I think this is the first successful hub I've actually built, like, ever. Because I attempted one when we done the Crazy SMP server. And we haven't done the one the Vulture SMP server yet. <laughs> and any other survival I've done, I haven't actually done the the hub. So yeah, this is this is my first successful nether hub and it's working this far. Oh, hmm. That's okay, you can barely even see the, the end stone through that. Right, that's good. Excellent. Uh, but yeah, I'm, I'm really enjoying this. I'm enjoying being able to go from place to place in the nether without being shot by a ghast or harassed by blaze or whatever. So yeah, it's it's fun. Oh, well, it's good. Also, the fact that I do need to um, watch out in case I fall in lava or off high ledges or whatever is pretty interesting as well. Where did oh you must have spawned the top of one of the stairs. Goodbye. Now oh yes, that's right. My inv inventory management is just completely <laughs> messed up. Ah. Anyways, let us continue on. I've also redone the nether portal and put some defensive blocks behind it. Of course they fit this theme. So yeah, that's also another good thing. I can't believe I just done that. Let's go through and get those blocks. <laughs> we we will be needing them for the talk seg talk top. Yes, it's, it, I'm feeling really warm, so that's why I'm speaking like that. It's oh, it's not a nice feeling. And where did those blocks go? Hmm. Damn it! They may have disappeared. Oh well, it it happens. Anyways, onwards. Plus we have more stairs there anyways that we can use. Now, oh yes that's right, it's this segment. So we're either going to use the iron bars or the glass. Now, I don't know what will look better. So what we'll do is we'll do iron bars on one side and then we'll do glass on the other. And we'll, we'll see how it looks. Yeah. Also, if I got my render distance turned up, no I don't, because it's really laggy right now. Also, you know how I said I was planning building a PC later on this year? It might not actually happen, because money's been a problem, so... Yeah, I'll have to make do with this. Might need to just re replace the CPU or something. Because that is the troubled area. Now, how does that look? Now, the good thing about the iron bars is the colour contrasts a lot, so... You don't really focus, your eyes don't really focus on all the purple, but since this is kind of purple, it's a slightly brighter purple than the rest of it, it's magenta actually. It takes away from the purple as well. I don't know though, but please let me know in the comments if you like the... I, I don't know, just let me know, even though I wouldn't see it for a few weeks. But yeah, <laughs> please let me know, it will be a big help. Oh dear. I don't know, um, hmm, I really like the iron bars, the more expensive um, option of course, since we don't have a farm operation for that yet, I don't know, um, hmm, I think I'm going to go with the iron farm, not the iron farm, the iron bar option, <laughs> yeah it's, it's too warm, it's like, 22, de 22 degrees here in Scotland, Celsius. Now you may be thinking, oh that isn't warm. But for a country that's used to receiving minus 5 on a daily basis, <laughs> yeah, and we don't have any air conditioning. Well, we, well not really. Uh, not to the extent that some places do, so <laughs> yeah. It's basically a case of sitting with your window open, which doesn't help because the air is just as warm outside. Right, so replacing all of that so yeah 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 I'm liking it plus with the way we've done the end stone in the back of it it looks a bit better as well 
and I can't place blocks because I am incompetent. <laughs> yep. Okay, and now the fun begins. So, what we need as I don't know. Hmm. Now what I was wanting to do is I was wanting to incorporate stairs like this. But this may look strange with the way we've um, we've done this segment here as well. So maybe what we need to do is if we take out this segment, we run that very fast. And we do something like that. Okay. And what else? What else should what should we do now? I don't want to have too much of Hmm. Because we could use some of the ends to have it a little bit more visible. Yeah, yeah. That that actually works. It works pretty well when you think about it. Also that we've actually put um this stuff around the wrong way anyways, so yeah, that's why I was struggling to do it earlier. Right, right, right. I can be a little bit silly sometimes when it comes to building. I don't know, maybe I'm, I'm, I'm under stress or something. Yeah. Oh, well, that's good that we've um, spotted that mistake. Pretty simple, really. And we'll do the same up here. And we'll just leave that block. We have plenty of them. And we fix the simple rookie mistake that we made. So... Per, per blocks and stone bricks repeat the pattern yeah that actually that, that that works a lot better yeah it's a hundred times better when you look at it because now everything doesn't look as strange so we're, we're almost there folks almost there so if you want to build a net well an end themed tunnel now you can <laughs> Because you have, you have, um, you can totally copy my design. Yeah, you can, you can totally do it. Uh, I, I won't sue you or anything. We'll work with that. Hmm. <laughs> now, to finish off, we should probably just go through and quickly place all of the blocks because I really need to a break because it's too warm in this room. I need to go and walk about. But as of the day of recording, that's with the way I'm both recording. As currently four days until I go on vacation. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to it, I really am. I, I must tell you though, I feel as if I need it. It's been, well, two years, I think, since I was last out of the country. So, yeah, this will be a fun thing to go and take a break from. So, um, almost done. But yeah, we're going to the likes of Kennedy Space Center and stuff, because Florida we're going to. So, yeah, fun. <laughs> So I, li I like all that space stuff and right so just just do this and that and this and that and last two segments and then we should be all done yeah yeah yeah, yeah. right that's looking good so if we could just go down this way and we look at the top yeah yeah that's looking good actually it does the job the damn boat Let's try and get a screenshot. We'll, we'll go in the center. So line up and take it. There we go. But yeah, guys, I'm afraid that is it for this episode. You know how it is with me bulk recording and stuff, and we're all a bit close to the camera. <laughs> but yeah, as always, if you like this video, please make sure to hit that like button. And if you really enjoyed it and you want to see more, make sure to subscribe. Thank you for watching, and as always, I'll see you guys next time.